add to a dramatic court battle involving one of Vancouver's most high-profile businessmen. Canucks owner Francesco Aquilini is vehemently denying bombshell allegations that he abused his children. CTV's Angela Jung is following this story, and Angela, we are also hearing from his ex-wife today. That's right, Mi Jung. The Aquilini family drama is once again playing out in public. The pair has been divorced for nearly a decade, and this has all come out at their latest child support hearing in court. Talia Aquilini has applied for continued child support for three of their youngest adult children who live with her while in university. Her lawyer says she's disappointed she has to go to court again to enforce his child support responsibilities. A representative for the Canucks owner says Mr. Aquilini has met and will continue to meet any child support obligations required by the law. But he has concerns about the veracity of the information provided in support of financial demands. It is unfortunate that allegations without merit are brought forward for a collateral purpose. But his ex-wife's lawyer fires back and says Mr. Aquilini has been in possession of all the affidavits for many months now. And as I mentioned in court, he has not given any evidence denying any of that affidavit evidence. Talia Aquilini also claims the children are estranged from their father. Now, what's going on here is that uh, the uh, Mrs. Aquilini is obviously saying, well, uh, yes, that's true. They're not they don't have a relationship with their father and they don't want one. But that's because he uh, is a child abuser. And that is a shocking allegation uh, to be made. Again, Mr. Aquilini vehemently denies these claims. The NHL confirms the league is aware of the allegations, adding the Aquilinis are clearly in a contentious divorce, and it will continue to monitor the situation. Mi Jung? Okay, thank you, Angela.